Hello, and welcome back to Shogun 2, Father Samurai Jozai Legendary Campaign. So last time we left off, we had defended Miyagi against two of the Matsume stacks who are now entirely dead. And the plan is now to go and take... Oh man, that movement was pretty crap. Uh, plans to take Uzen, which I guess we'll be able to do next turn. Um, we're just moving a bunch of stuff over and such. Um, let's start with the most obvious things, which is just these units that aren't going to actually reach yet. Why the hell? Is he over there? Like, I moved him into the town and then moved him up north. I guess he just stepped out there instead of in the center. That's kind of odd. What a weirdo. Right, our shins are going to be ranked up. So let's uh, level him up to become better at converting towns. That's what we do, right? Let's check this guy real quick. Yes, okay. And then we don't go for that first kill. Roy, makes sense. Always got to remind myself. See, every time, telescope. With every agent we level up, we get the telescope as an option. Uh, that's really crap as well, to be honest. I'm not going to put him in an army anyway, but... It's like... Make him better at being in an army, but also, at the same time, make, him make the army worse because of it. It's like... Like, why? Why is this a combination? Why isn't it just, like... Why isn't it plus 7%? Like, plus 1 to... Aesthetic discipline isn't even that good. The telescope's even worse, but... I'm going to go for that. I mean, give us that extra bit of vision. Yeah. Right. Um, sp uh, ninja, I'm going to go up here before I do anything, because I need to know if they're not, if, they're not, if there's not another army coming. Doesn't look like it just yet, so that's good. Um, I think we definitely want to get as close as possible with the army, and then we'll have... Let's see, we need five units, or yeah, we can move five units out, six, and that's, yeah, okay, so we can, we can move out as much as we want, technically. Um, let's just move out four of the guys. Do I accompany the general? Oh. Uh, it makes a slight difference, but very freaking slight. Um, alright, so, actually, no, let's, you know, let's just move up two units, yeah, we'll just move up two. I think, um, after this fight, I'm gonna get rid of these cannons. Alright, I'm gonna go up here and see if there's nothing coming from over there. Doesn't look like it. There's a blacksmith. They're going for the ironworks. 10 accuracy, 2 armor. Let's see, blacksmith. Okay, so that's the second level. That's perfect. And then we want to go for either this one or the gunsmith, which is the one we're actually going to go for. The gunsmith gives us accuracy and less armor. This one gives us less accuracy, more armor. Um, but armor seems pointless when you're facing off against guns which don't care about armor. So I want to move them forward just a little bit to so make sure they can actually reach next turn. I, I assume my army can reach too, but just in case. Uh, hopefully we don't lose any units. I might just take out the calf, these wounded ones, but we're replenishing a little bit as well. So, um, Alright. So that's all good. Yeah, you guys should actually stay with the army. It that's the plan. It will be my pleasure. It will be my pleasure. <laughs> it will be my, my pleasure. Be I'm glad it's your pleasure. This army or this place is happy. Plus two. We got plus one from spring. Not sure where the other plus one is coming from. Recent event? No, that's the spring thing. Um. Because we had zero at some point, so I guess I guess I can get rid of one unit here, but there's always the looming thing, like, if this happens, we're going to have to get rid of, or we're going to have to get an extra unit in there anyway, so. I'm not sure if it's worth it. Um, it probably is for now, but I don't care enough, and my money isn't that much of an issue. I could even put him in there, but I feel like it'd be useful to keep him around here in case we need something at the front lines done. You know what? I'll, I'll get rid of him, just because I'm I love min maxing like an absolute motherfucker. So yeah, I could get rid of another one right now, but then in two turns we we'll have to, or three turns we we'll have to get rid of, or we we'll have to get another one in there again. So that's pointless to do that right now. Right. So this army is gonna meet up with this one when we can get everything out of here, which is gonna be probably now actually. Yeah, we can we can move everything out now. So we're going to do that now. It's going to be minus two. Next turn is going to be minus one. And mounting a rest of turn after that's going to be minus zero. Actually, no. Then that's going to go away. So... Yeah, we may have to make a unit here now. Um, do it next turn. Min-maxing. 
Right. Yes. See, I'm probably gonna get rid of these two after I've taken the town, but I might as well just because this means I can get out. Well, I guess I I couldn't have gotten there a turn earlier because this guy could have reached next turn anyway. And we're not gonna attack this turn, so it doesn't really make much of a difference. But it it's good because it it'll probably lose us less units. We have 2,400 bucks. I don't think that's enough for anything in any of our places. Nine, definitely not. What have we even got in Miyagi? Got a gambling den. Oh right, yeah. I do want to actually get rid of this and make the second, the other building here. It's kind of annoying because it's going to be a lot of money switching it over. But this is definitely one of the better provinces, so we want to get as much money from it as possible. Um, yeah, sure. Let's do it now. Also, we can see here they've got the Buddhist shrine, plus five to charge bonus. Oh, that's, okay, so yeah, it's the first level, right? So we actually do need to... we got to get Silk somehow. And then we can upgrade it. To... Plus 10 charge, and then plus 15. Don't require anything else for this, though. So It's definitely something I want, but it's not going to be likely I'll be able to do it. They've also got a barracks here. Which I don't care about too much, but do have the traditional dojo, so I can make my Yari Ki immediately. With only plus 5, but still, it's fine. I don't know how they got golden upgrades there for charge. I don't know what the hell else they could have done for that. That seems weird. Um, yeah, I don't know what the hell. And we can we can start making our gun units here as well, but we're we're gonna make them up here. We're gonna want to make them up there anyway. So, right. Anyway, can't spend our money. We're gonna get rid of this building. Possibly not the best idea since we're gonna take that time we'll to spend some money on that too. But whatever. And our income's gonna take a bit of a drop from that as well, I think. What are you guys doing? <laughs> just go back to your town. There's an army there. An army and a half now. You probably could have taken them when they were just when when they just arrived, but don't know about now anymore. Don't know what in the world they're doing. Okay, well they finally lost their town, so now they're gonna have to do something, I imagine. And that also means that right now we are bordering someone who likes us, but we're not allied with or is my vassal. So yeah, we lost our vassal, I guess. Clan destroyed. And I go, okay, yeah. And even if they do take it back, they're not going to be my vassal anymore. They're just going to have no ties to anyone. So that's that's uh, unfortunate. But it, the good thing is that I don't think you lose your honor. No, you got the plus one vassal. If you, if you break the alliance of your vassal, you do lose the honor. Um, but we didn't. Tosa. Who are you? You're Imperial scum! Actually, they're one of the major clans, aren't they? Okay. Right. Keep yes. going up here. I need to I need to know what's going on in this crazy place. Keep going this way. We got her going this way, so... I'm assuming they're gonna have units from somewhere. Oh, there's the freaking Morioka. I have to declare war on them soon. Sheesh. Can I, like... Oh, I can distract them. Be funny if I... Oh, actually, what? What's that do again? Phantom supporting any forces. Okay, right. Okay, right. Get in there. And then attack. Death and honor and all that. I right, got silver charge now. You can get reinforcement range. That's good enough. Or can you? Yeah, you can. Destination reached. Okay. All the other stuff. Let's get it moving. Uh, no mounting and rest there. Somewhat surprisingly, not sure why the world, why the world dies. It was definitely unhappy. Not sure, um, but I don't. I can't say I care. So much moving. This is why I always wait for units to arrive. Right. Um, so next turn it'll still be minus one because that's gonna go away. But it, there's no mounting arrest. So I don't have to make that unit that I was talking about earlier. Right. Let's take this first, see what we have to do money-wise here. Ooh, no units lost. Cannon's even got some experience. Oh my god, Yuga Gitani! <laughs> There's definitely something wrong with the auto resolve. Speaking of which, if that's the case, we ain't, like, as our clan, we have that special thing where we can feel like six more Yuga Gitai than normal or something. Maybe I should use that. Maybe we should just feel like only Yuga Gitai and then auto resolve is gonna be like. 700 kills for every Shinkiki <laughs> unit every time. It's crazy. 
anyway. Ugh. Again. It's like, oh man, give me the money, but not happening. Right. No, I've got the chance to make a ninja, so I'm not going to get rid of this building yet. Oh, actually, we don't want to get rid of the building anyway, because we want to get um, the area key. So we can make revolver cav already as well. So yeah, we get an exceptional charge here. 33. That's... Wait, what's the normal charge bonus then? These guys are experienced, so it's hard to tell. You're on 23. That's already so improved, like... You're on 23 as well, with much less experience. How does that work? Um... Okay, so I guess they don't get any charge bonus from more experience. But why is it green then? There must be some reason. Oh, right, it's because the, um... Plus 8 from that. Okay. So... It doesn't... It shouldn't incorporate that in here, though, should it? No, because these guys are silver and these guys are gold. So there's something that gives me... That gives my cav extra charge bonus. But whatever we get from here, if there is something from here, which I don't think there is... Whatever it is... It shouldn't give us... A different color because it shouldn't calculate that in here this is only from bonuses you get from the buildings speaking of which we do want to upgrade this so we can build the well let's have to get rid of this which I'll probably do because I don't want revolver calf with charge bonus I don't think I want this building here at all um, as much as I do want revolver calf by the way we're gonna totally fucking build 65 of those um, anyway I um, I do want to upgrade this do I? No. What was I gonna say? Oh yes, no, I don't want, I, I wanna make that other building. The uh, the encampment thing. Well it's not an encampment in Fall of Samurai, but you know what I mean. Probably not. Hey, we got silk already. Well in that case this is priority over that building, which I was kind of afraid of. Um we get rid of the barracks, which is unfortunate, because we finally have availability to these units. We don't care about Saber Calf, never gonna build them because they're crap. It's like Katana Calf versus Yari uh, Yari Calf. You don't want Katanas, they're shit. Seen in the game. Um, so we're gonna go to the barracks and then we're gonna build that encampment ish building. Okay, I think we're gonna wait here a little bit. I don't, I'm not gonna wait for units to make for, for making units. We're gonna send the armies up this way until we take all that stuff and then we'll worry about it. Although by that time, maybe there's a roll of the vibe, but we'll see. Yeah, it's taking a not taking too long before we're gonna get there. Um, but yeah, that's the plan. We're going to keep standing stuff up. We'll just make units over time. We're not going to wait for replacements because it's going to take too long. So we want to get this and then we want to get the second level as well. Since we already have silk apparently, we may as well. I'm not sure where we're getting it from. Do we have it ourselves? Are we, tra are we trading for it? We're importing it, yeah. From whom? Ada. Okay, that's a reliable source then, I, I suppose. Um, yeah, and I want to get the other building up before I make any other units anyway. Okay, right. That's all done. S money is spent... That sounds good. Let's con actually let's go to the cannons. That's that's a good idea. Get the fuck out of here. I'm half time with the parrot guns, but just one unit is not worth it because your movement gets slowed by these two or by this one unit. I will definitely field cannons. Don't worry about that. One hundred percent. But if I do, I'll probably have at least two because I just I know it's only one more than one. Obviously, I mean I'm pretty sure you guys can all do math that well. Um. But it just makes it it makes it worth so much more. Just having your entire army slow down for one unit is just like, ugh, no, not worth it. But two is already so much better. There you go. So Ugo got taken, which means we can't even... Well, we can take it, of course, but we don't even really want to. Because I don't really want to go to war with them as well right now. Although they're probably in a fairly vulnerable position, because I'm pretty sure that's all their forces right there. Uh, trade agreement broken. With whom, actually? I didn't even check. Kakagama, okay. Sea Trader Rated, Technology Research, right. So we got Modern Rifles, so we can now make the Military Academy, which means we can make Yukikitai. Carbine Cavalry. This gives us the Carbine Cav, which I don't think are as good as Revolver Cav. They're different, but not worse or better. Um, still don't really care about Neo Fire, to be honest. I think we're probably going to go back to... I, I do want imported guns, but... I, we're going to be focusing mainly on military or, or um, line units for a moment anyway, so I don't care too much about that. Because once once we get here, I'm going to want to build the encampment type building, uh, like I'm building here as well, but for the gun one. And then, like, later on, because we need three uh, building slots, and we're, we're only going to have two for a while, so. Uh, nope, still don't care about that. We One of them, this one and that one, is that's really good. Um, 
foreign veterans. I haven't even got any of those yet. Do you get them from the ports? I can't remember. I guess you need a trading port or something. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna take a bit of a detour here. Just go full on money. Money, money, money. Summer. You know, replenishment. Pretty useful right about now. Alright, so you guys get in there. You guys are gonna keep going through right away. You're gonna replace these two cannons I just got rid of. You guys are just gonna go in there. You guys are just gonna go in there. You guys are just gonna go in there. And you guys are just gonna go in there. Still no, still no mounting arrest. I guess because it technically it's going down one, and then the summer or the spring thing goes away, and then we lose one. So it's like it already calculated the points before anything happened, essentially. So yeah, this place is on zero now. Right, um, over here, encampment building, so I can finally freaking see what it's called. Training camp, that's the one. And then the training camp, we're gonna upgrade to a. No. Yes, to a drill school, which gives us plus 15 charge bonus to our cavalry. Holy shit! That's pretty insane. Um, over here, we still want to rebuild the inn, which, yeah, I shouldn't have gotten rid of it yet. Hello, enemy ninja. How may I serve you? Um, As well, you wish. that's a question. Is that all, my lord? That's a tiny army incoming, but still an army incoming, so i got to keep track of that. Are we going to go on the offensive right away? Actually, can you see what they've got in here? Yari Ki, Yari Kachi. So yeah, we can see that's all good units, but I think we're still going to be fine with our big army. We can make the, the Shinobi now. Let's go ahead and do that. My Lord. Welcome to the team, Shinobi. Um, can make some crazy charge. Oh my god, 21 charge point for levy infantry. Honestly, it's not even a bad idea. Let's go straight, like, just only recruit, like, the weakest units and just get full-on charge bonus. Online, no one would ever expect it. Oh, I just got Levy Infantry, what an idiot. Wait, why right, is Levy Infantry running towards me? Wait, Levy Infantry, stop! <laughs> what are you doing? Stop! And then they're dead. End, end, end of the story. I know, it was a great story. I know I know all of you wanted to, it to go on as long as possible, but, you know, sometimes you gotta call quits. Anyway, question is, do I go on the attack? I think I'll, I'll, I'll let my guys replenish for another turn or two. Or at least, yeah. I'll, I'll start moving next turn once we have the army or these two units in there as well. So we'll, the turn after probably. I'm gonna deal with happiness here too, actually. Just a little bit, but still. Um, Miyagi, Miyagi was incredibly unhappy because it was uh, the Senpai capital. Senpai? No, that doesn't. Sendai capital at some point. So yeah. I still feel I don't feel good about this choice because it's gonna like 18 turns. It's a long commitment. I do want to make a detour party for imported guns, and j this one is like mad. This one is a good one. Clan wide tax rate plus 10 percent is insane. But yeah, gotta just stick with it for now. Right, I think that's enough. That's enough. Our second army is essentially gonna be done in a minute as well. I mean, we still lost a few units, so I'm gonna have to remake a few of the spear crappy units. The spear crappy units. Oh. Hmm. That's those people that just took up my vassal, isn't it? Which means I'm gonna have to send an army back to deal with that. Oh, sh I don't know where to. Yeah, they're, they're likely gonna attack me in Fukushima then, I guess. Uh, I won't call Edo to help. Well, they probably would join me, but that would be really bad, because. Conflict. They won't have anyone join them either, luckily. Yeah, they're the, these people, I think. It's gonna cause a bit of a ruckus, though. Because obviously they're allied to a whole bunch of people that I am also friends with. But as long as my ally doesn't break their alliance with me, I am totally fine. So yeah, it's these people. Okay, so they own. Uh, this place, which I do want anyway, so that would work out, taking that. We know they've got an army and a half there, though. And then they own a bunch of territories over here. Why the fuck they declared war on me is obviously beyond me, but... What peace? No? That's odd. Hey, freed up some trade, though. Mm, Sado. Why do you pay me some money, eh? Be seated. I will order tea 
and we will have agreement before sunset. Wow. Not if you are so damn stingy, sir. Okay, fine. I'm sure someone would pay me something, but... Oh, I can get another one anyway, so that's fine then. Uh... Tosa. You are here like an honest man at the front gate. Yep. Better that, I suppose, than an the assassin, assassin over the, the wall. wall. Extremely honest. Mr. Honesty right here. Oh, man. 179. Sure. Speak plainly. Speak quickly. Your presence is not entirely... Yeah, yeah, I fucking get it, mate. Like, everyone goddamn hates me. It's like, I know. But everyone wants my goods as well right now, so... Yes, Guess I shan't lord. complain. Alright, we're saving that point, apparently. <laughs> uh, Alright, so army has to go back now, so... Cancel all that. Uh, which kind of makes our position here a little more annoying, but... Not too big a deal. Okay. Um, yeah, it makes it pretty annoying, actually. I'm tempted to leave some stuff behind. This gives us a general... Um... Um... Right. Well, you may serve me by going this way. Wasn't going to do that, but obviously that is now necessary. Where did I put their army? Hi! I shall rest hmm. a while. That's interesting. I could pause this this campaign here, because I can get peace with them, but I don't really want to. You're gonna keep going. Yeah, because this is just this means our army is done. Can you no you're not gonna be able to get pulled in. Look, it doesn't work. Oh it does, never mind. Fought. Usually when they sit down you can't pull them in, but when they're still standing up you can. Thing is this place is still unhappy, so I can't actually really move out of here anyway. So what does this give us? This gives us 8 plus 6, which is 14. I can count. And that's another 6. Okay, so we did have a full stack, 20, 20 then. Uh, that's 4 and 3. Okay, so that's 7. Spear Levy, 2 Generals, 4 Yari Ki, and 6 Yari Kachi, and the 1 Match Lakachi. Right, that's why it's even. Okay. Um, so yeah, that's, that is a full stack, so I think I will take it all out, and that will mean that this is going to be mine. Okay, it's going to be two, I take out 16, it's going to be minus four, so I can exempt it from taxes if I have to. I'm probably just going to start making some crappy units here now. Uh, actually, I'll start with the inn. Alright. The, the biggest problem with this is that I don't know where their army is gone. That's one problem of, of this, anyway. Um... It's probably down this way. Oh yep, there it is, okay. So, that means that we're going to take this army... Oh, I shouldn't have moved those units then. We're going to take this army this way instead. Um, and just keep... Well, we attack them and then we'll attack these guys from here or... or like, from here or here. We'll have to see what the best play is. Um, but that that means that we're like we just don't declare war on them yet. We'll finish this town off. There's no other towns we can take here on this island that belongs to them. So then we're gonna have to take these guys out and then we'll go up there. I can even make a small navy, send the stuff around, but they have a lot of navy. So in fact, they bombarded us, didn't they? They came down here somewhere. Yeah, I must have failed. I can make one gunboat. Yes. Yes. The only problem is I don't know where they are, but I don't think they can reach before these guys get... Well, these guys might be a little too late. We'll have to wait and see. Um, okay, so yeah. Con of 40 units. I can make one levy infantry. It's just to keep happiness. Yeah, so it doesn't really matter what we make, actually. In fact, levy infantry might be better if we're going to sit on hills, or towns, even. Okay. Um, that's all good, then. Let's keep going. So yeah, kind of annoying that they declared war on us, but hey, what are you going to do? Luckily, we're not too far away. It's just kind of annoying that I literally just almost got my second army there. It's like, yeah, now we can take him on like, easily. We can just send one army one way and the other one the other way. And then, whoop. They decide to declare war on me. These guys are likely going to take that town before I even get there. So I'm probably going to have to end up declaring war on them anyway. But it means I'll be able to take out their large army right away. Because it'll be in the place that we're going to. Mounting and rest in the Miyagi. Um, 
That's pretty unfortunate. Wait. Oh, come on. So I paid them two grand and I still got a negative effect? That's fucking rough. That's gonna be, that's gonna be really bad, in fact. That's causing, like, everything to be on it. Oh, my word. For six turns as well. Um... Yeah, we have to just get lower taxes for a few turns. Yeah, that's probably the answer. Um, however, I'm going to... Tatsuno dead. I'm going to end the episode here. So next time... Ooh, hoo, hoo, next time. Next time nothing actually is happening. Well, we're going to take... We're going to keep going north. We're going to go this way and protect against these fools over here. Have the Aizu people come in as reinforcements, of course. Oh, that's how we kill them. We need to somehow lure... I don't know. Well, we need to let this place rebel. And then a rebellion attacks. And then these guys might come in as reinforcements or something. Because it'll be Aizu rebels, wouldn't it? Oh my god, that's what we have to have happen. We need to let this place rebel. That's it. <laughs> Finally figured it out. Anyway, that's going to be it for now. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Until next time, have a good day and goodbye.